Outsiders, here we are, week seven. Woohoo! Okay, so we had to keep moving, all right? Do some exercise, go outside. Well, actually, you went outside last week, right? Okay, next week you're going to go outside again. But this week, we're going to work indoors, okay? All right, so this in here that you see, this is my tape, mug, box, paper, and ruler painting. Oh, I know, you're confused. It doesn't look like a paper, huh? All right, now, remember Malevich, the one you just saw? Okay, so that's my Malevich work, okay? So Malevich was an abstract artist. What went into Malevich's mind was that when he looked at something, he would focus on how he feel about it, and he would connect to whatever he was looking, and he would create his paintings. So his paintings were sometimes just shapes. And when he made abstract art, if you remember abstract art, right, that paintings work, artworks that don't have like people. Remember Jackson Pollock? Jackson Pollock, abstract art. So shapes, lines, color, that's abstract art. So Malevich was a master of abstract art. When he created his abstract art at the beginning of 20th century, he became world famous, okay? So he was from Russia, Kazimir Malevich. Now, let's talk a little bit more how we're going to do this. So what I would like you to do is go somewhere, find some things that you can look from above, okay? Like in a movie. Have you checked Maddie and Dada movie that I put there for you for Malevich? If you have not, check it out because that's a very cool movie, okay? Maddie and Dada Malevich is with the lesson there on the web page. So... Malevich liked to look at things from above, and then he would create his shapes. So what I did is I set my table here, and I put a step stool, and I'm going to show you in a minute when I change camera, okay? Now, what you can do is you can go from somewhere on your house where you can see things from above. Maybe you can go steps up and look at from the steps, okay? So look from somewhere where you can see things from above, take a picture, it's better to take a picture and then look at your picture and draw your Malevich, okay? So this one here is my ruler, my mug, my tape, my paper, and my box, which you're going to see it right now, okay? All right, Hillsiders, so let's do our Malevich. Okay, so now that I have the other camera, I'm going to show you my table that I have set here, okay? Table. Now, what I have in my table, I have some items that I was working. I just left them there, okay? I didn't organize, okay? I was working with them. I just left them there. Now, I put a step stool because like Malevich, I like to look at things from above. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to climb my step stool. So now I can see it from far away, all of that stuff, right? And I'm going to take a picture. Now, see, I'm going to use this picture, and I'm going to create my Malevich. Okay? That's what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to put it right here. So, I'll look at the picture, and then I'm going to draw here the shapes that I saw in the picture. Okay? So, let me take a look. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see. All right. So... Have a title for my work. You know how I'm gonna call it? I'm gonna call it table with mug, paper, ruler, and box. Got it? That's the name of my painting. Now, when you look at that, do you see a table or ruler? No, we don't, but I see it because it's my creation. So that's what it matters. The artist is the creator. It doesn't matter what people think about it. What it matters is what you create and what you think about your art. Go ahead, do your Malevich, and I'm looking forward to see it. Okay? Bye-bye, Hillsider artists. See you in a bit.